as we say Doherty's, we say Martin as obvious we say Martin Doherty, which is a proper respectable word from proper respectable people. But when we listen to you, Martin Doherty, you don't even know who you are. Obvious we know that you're having all fake names your license and you're saying you're Doherty men. And as my old fella says, to me grandfather, great grandfather had a one eyed stand. He never did have a one eyed stand. I told me old fella, which he knows that himself. Ye were born from the bogs of Innes Diamond when an old hillbilly grandfather, father, when an old hillbilly father, and the world knows that you're not Dorties, but he had three real aunts, which was his Mary, Big Bernadette, and Lizzie, which was proper aunts, Tiv, my great-grandfather, old Simon Doherty. But for your father, no one knows what he was bred for. It could be in a puck, chicken, or a sheep. That's why I called you that. So we don't know what you are. We know you're chickens, sheep, or pucks from the Highlands. So, as I said to me, old fella, please, father, I'm not disrespecting you. He ain't bred from that breed. I know he said, son, you're fucking right, my Barney. You're fucking right. He's bred from a puck or a sheep or a chicken. So we all know that. Then you turn around and say about Polly, Polly the Winer. Right. Polly the Winer was a world champion to train Rocky, and the world knows that. And what is what is what a Simon, a world champion. When you haven't got a man for me from twenty to fifty, how would you have a man for my brother, a legend? A legend. The man had put his hands and I ain't going at fifty. Maybe the half the man that he is, I don't know, but it ended me me day. I was the greatest. But look, I'm pushed on in years, but I'm still willing to take any out the road twenty to fifty. Not drink talk, never was. And the world knows I ain't a bluff. And trust me, he ain't a bluff, Sign me isn't. So if you've got a man for him or me, we will be gladly to take you out the road, sort your little fucking stupid brains out, and put you on a stupid talk, right? Now, you're talking about this one. Owl Ireton Ain, he was bred from the best of both worlds. Owl Barney McGinley and Owl Billy Darty. That's what you call proper breeding. Yes, and I wear braid between McGindley and McDonough, which is fucking great breeding again. And we're very proud of our background. We love the McDonough's, I'm happy self. But the McDonough's, my Uncle Patrick forget what he's talking about, where he came from. But his family, we cannot say it, where he came from. Which the grandfather, old Michael McDonough, was a great man, which is my great grandfather, my great, my, sorry, my grandfather, which is a great Michael McDonough, highly respect for the McDonough's. We love them, but we don't love Patrick or the family because Patrick lost his way when he started breeding with sheep and pucks and chickens. So I think that's what Patrick has gone wrong. And you wouldn't mind these little men. I'd love to take every one of them on the back road and bait them all. And si <laughs> Simon, <laughs> the man would be done for murder. Murder. That's what Simon would be done for. Now you're all about Connie Ho. Had about his son Shane a five foot one and this and that. When you haven't got a man for Alan and Shane the boys, how would you have been for the likes of us? You couldn't have. And you're on about, ah, oh, you're gunmen, this and that. Ah, come on, lads. I don't see much action done with ye. Only a load of shit talk on YouTube. Martin, Martin, Martin Darty. Old Paddy's in the site and old man is disgusted ye. You blocks the roads, you blocks this. The old man makes a laugh for you. His family makes a laugh for you. Everyone makes a laugh for you because you'll be a laughing stock. Now, get back to Connie Ho, that he's a hippie, and his sons, respectable men, they're slippery like ourselves. We are liberties. That's, we don't live in council sites. We don't live in trailers with no arses in them, no curtains in them, which we've had a thousand times up. Ye are hillbillies knackers. Now, you said that Connie Ho was a, a hippie and why did Mary marry him to England and he worked with this and that and she did live? No, son. You're talking wrong. That was your father you were talking about. But you tried to switch over to the celebrity old man. So Ho, which is a proper king of the Zohos. Do you remember when your father went to, when your father went to Belfast to Johnny Tuppence, a celebrity like ourselves, owns properties, Family celebrities, proper celebrity, be father's real uncles. That's what you're talking about. When your father worked for 50 pence and a pound a day 
the Fiji snotty noses with had even a nappy on your arse when you left clear, innocent boys <coughs> left innes when you had nothing. When you landed down to that country in Belfast when old Johnny made a laugh ye. 50 pence, Mary, Mary. I'm paying the man 50 pence a day. Then I'm a god. He's pushing my uncle. That's what I'm talking about. Ye are hillbilly people. You'll never have nothing. You'll never have anything. And this is making a difference if you made a thousand tapes. You'll be the same sheep, knackers, pucks. So don't talk about me father's aunt Mary, his real aunt, Fanny's father's great, his, his great, his, sorry, excuse me, his, his grandfather, old Simon Darty, owned of them, me mother's sister. But for your father, give him a good bit in heaven. I'm not talking about the dead. I hope the man will be in heaven. And the man is looking on top of ye. And the man knows that I'm talking right. That you're wrong. Ye are wrong. Ye ain't Doherty's. I told me father. I told me brothers. Not be giving heat to hillbillies. That ain't, ain't Doherty's. Doherty's. Martin Doherty's. And you've got a man, some of the Valdon Shane. They're very happy to have a cracky G. But if you're not happy with them, come to me and out. Me brother sign me. And we will... Gladly take you out the road from 20 to 50 and turn your brain, which we aren't telling no lies. I'm one of 50, I train seven days a week, and I be lofty, blow the heads of your bodies. Ye you dirty hillbilly, and only rapers that I've ever seen, which I should be saying this God forgive me and our blessed mother. I'm a very little man. I go to Mass, I do my 